art for wellbeing. It's taken quite a long time to define what that meaning is and I think there's a real interest in understanding from commissioners and funders at the moment, particularly in the health sector, about how community-based activity can achieve some really strong wellbeing outcomes in a way that maybe traditional medical approaches can't. Creativity can be a real different way of voice and autonomy and a sense of control for individuals. I think participants that come to Art for Wellbeing programmes have an opportunity to express themselves. I think awareness of Art for Wellbeing is around, but I think it could be improved and brought more forward. I think there are some fantastic programmes around Greater Manchester and nationally and internationally that about Arts for Wellbeing and what that can mean for people. Collaboration is at the heart of a creative process. It's the collaboration between two people that often leads to a really beautiful piece of art or a way of expressing how somebody feels. I just think it's been really interesting how we've been able to use creative techniques to learn to work together with people that you've never met, make something that almost is more than the sum of the parts. Collaboration is something that I think is so needed and yet so often avoided because of people's time or uh, energies or whatever taken up. Collaboration works basically. I've always been a, a proponent of the idea that, that working with other people is the best way forward. So my message is basically give us more money for the arts, we'll use it wisely and the arts obviously are inextricably linked with your health and well-being. It has reinforced even more the importance of arts within helping people to remain well, to become more resilient. For me, it's all about participation, looking at how we work with participants to en engage them, encourage them, challenge them, and then the process of delivery is a feedback mechanism. I've met a lot of artists today who kind of inspired me to consider what I'm doing um, more creatively and to find the opportunity to tap into what they're doing. So to talk to the galleries, to be part of the local projects that are happening. 